What up, everybody? Welcome back to Red Dead, dude. So we just did, we just robbed some horses. We just robbed some horses. Now we're going to go to Trelawney. What's up, Bill? How's it going, Bill? Morning, Arthur. You did good, Valentine. Told you it'd be a good score. It was a good score. It was a very good score. Got me this new outfit because of that score. What's up, Lenny? Good work on that bank job. <laughs> Loved every minute. There'll be yeah, plenty more where that came from. Are you busy, Arthur? No, no, Trelawney actually was coming to talk to you. Why? Well, I know you think I'm just so cheap buffoon. What? A man of words and not of action. Hardly a man at all. Well, I think you're as slippery as an eel in an oil slick, but still a man. Because I think I've... I found something interesting. Yeah? Have you ever robbed a stagecoach? No, never. I <laughs> Of course Never. I'm goddamn stagecoach. Oh, I didn't lose my hat. Hell yeah. What's the problem with stagecoaches? The armed man attempting to put a bullet in your head. Not quite. The odds. I mean, is it worth the robbing? Sometimes. I know. But, well, if you'd like to come with me, I can introduce you to a new best friend, and he's he's going to give you all the decent, robbable stagecoaches a hot-blooded degenerate could require. Well, I could require a whole lot. All right, then. Come on, Mr. Green. We have an appointment. So where do we find this friend of yours? Roads. Because what can possibly go wrong there? Well, lead the way and we'll find out. You sure seem to have got a bout around here. You know me. I like to make I don't know why. low places. I don't know I why. Know you end up down here anyway. I'll, I'll wait till I've been talking. I the same of you. I have a few commitments over this way. Some expenses to meet. Expenses? What expenses? Gentlemen's canes and rabbits to pull out of hats. Among other things, I had quite a nice little business going for a while. Shares in a gold mining company. Excellent oh, really? For the investor of a certain financial standing. Until, well, that unfortunate run-in with the law. Yeah, that's how it goes. Thanks for disappearing on us during that Sean business, by the way. I've done my part. Each to their strengths, dear boy. I mean, I guess you, you have know, a point. You boys should really watch yourselves with those two families. This is a small town. People talk. Yeah, true. I to Osea, but you know how he is. Anyway, while they're off chasing their pot of Confederate gold hidden at the end of some rainbow... Excuse me. Let me present you with something real. So... Where exactly are we going? Here we are. We can hitch up outside. I'll make the introductions, Arthur. I was gonna say, I don't know why, um... My gun is always out every time I get on my horse and I have to put it away. I don't do that. It's just automatic. Come on. Hang back a bit. Let's go, Trelawney. What is that? Was that supposed to mean, Trelawney? Wow, you just walked right in that door. I caught some reprobate shambling around my backyard yesterday. Went straight to the law, of course. I swear, this place is going straight to hell. Hello, Paul. What the fuck is he talking about? And you, friend? Fucking damn. I said times are tough. My missus is a bad woman. Terrible. Trelawney, you just want to shoot this whole town up? But how's work, Alden? 
terrible. Wages got cut again. They reckon they just invented a new horse's carriage will be the end of us. <laughs> They've been saying that nonsense since they invented the wheel. The wickedness of bosses. I know. My comrades here and I are greatly discouraged from the adequate fulfillment of our duty. A discouraged man is no man at all, Alden. No man at all. My friend Arthur here has a present for you. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> I was just enthralled in your guys' talk. Here. Ain't you kind, sir? Call him Arthur. He's one of us, a fellow man of distinction. Okay. Well, this is perfect timing. I think you'll like this one, guys. It'll be coming south down the river road at the Siltwater Strand. Thank you, Alden. Thank you very much. You can kind of notice. If you or Arthur are ever out nah, never mind. Way, ask for my colleague there. Feller called Hector. He's also one of the, what did you call us again? Discouraged men, Alden. That's it, discouraged men. I like that. Well, goodbye, Alden, or should I say, adieu. Oh, adieu, Josiah. <laughs> Is it just me, or does Arthur's face look a little more detailed than... That dude that we were just talking to his face. I thought you might like to see. I don't know. It might just be me, but. River Road through Siltwater Strand, he said. Okay, I think I know a good spot to wait. Follow me. I don't know about Jose, Jose, Jose's, but uh, looked for a second there that that guy's face was a little. A little less detailed. Which way? Where are we going? All right. Let's go then, Hosea. Or should I call you Josiah? Simple as can be. Seems a lot of the station workers are in on it these days. Earning a pittance, the unions are whipping them up, so they want something on the side. Like he said, there, strawberry. Would you a lot of opportunities for a man in your line of work? I ain't sure about going back to strawberry after all that market. Strawberry. It's not like you left anyone alive to recognize you, so I wouldn't worry too much, dear boy. For real, bro. All this trouble, you gentlemen are becoming quite the celebrities, aren't you? I wonder who the well. I know who the oldest in the group is. It's Uncle, but I wonder who the second oldest is. I think it's Dutch. Oh no, it's not. It's fucking. Um... What the hell's that guy's name? It's Dutch's right hand man. Yeah, this is the, spot. the dude with the gray hair that we hunted a bear with. Don't quite remember his name. Okay. This should do. Sure. Here. I'm hoping we won't need those. Uh, better safe than sorry. What were you thinking? Well, according to this, the Maybe look I should use that gun oil. Strong box, which is in the back. I'll put on a little performance, and you can scurry around, open the strong box, and relieve them of their goodies. And how do I open the strong box without threatening someone to open it for me? This should work. <laughs> and I can do this silently? Well, I'm hoping complete silence won't be necessary. But you're going to wish you had your earplugs. This is Damson. Oh, very good, Alden. Very good. Of course, everything goes very right. good. Very, very good. Very good. Like you normally do. Hold tight. They'll be here soon. All right. There it is, right on time. Lock breaker. Keep your distance so they don't see you. And please leave that gun in its holster for once. All right, one, two, three, four, five.
Chester Damson. We're going to do it. We're going to do it first try. A mezzo soprano? Miss Damson, you owe it to West Elizabeth. I, 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 I don't know. <laughs> That's our cue. That is our cue. Oh, I was about to be like, keep going, keep going. I'm glad I don't have to do the lock picking. Damn. Isn't he driving you? How much was that? I didn't notice. All right. <laughs> like a freaking... Like it, I like it, like I weren't, like I was never there. I don't know what the hell I'm trying to say, but I was never there. All right. That's what I'm talking about. Come on, Trelawney, come back here. Oh, I have to go to Trelawney, all right. Hell yeah. Well done, sir. Well done. It was easy. Yeah, it was. Teamwork, my dear boy. Teamwork. It's the easiest one we've done yet, I feel like. Oh, it's only good. Go see Alden from time to time. See you soon, Arthur. Oh, I guess... 750, okay. For more information about stage coasters, go, oh, okay. Not bad, not bad. Not bad at all, mate. Not bad at all. Okay, boy. All right, where are we going? Jose, is he the last one? All right. <laughs> We're moving swiftly along, aren't we? Damn, I meant to. Hold on. Um. Can I eat one of the, them right quick? And then 
can I biscuits? Potent health care, bitters, potent health care, snake oil, cocaine gum. Cocaine gum, dude. Tobacco, yarrow, ginseng. Hair pomade, gun, gun oil. Keep this. Keep your gun. One second. Can I not use it? I don't know. Anyway, let's go to Hosea. Oh, we were just talking to Trelawney. Hosea is the one I'm thinking about. The dude with the gray hair that we did the bear stuff with. That we hunted the bear with. I, I don't know why, but I always mix up their names it, it is not it's not on mate it's not on we're in roads again I'm not going back Actually, we're going to go this way. I'm going to do a little shortcut. <laughs> Excuse me. Just taking a stroll through this field. Oh, damn it. Sorry, Mr. Green. See, he did it again. I don't know why he does that. I didn't think that tree would hit me either. Look at Dutch Pinkertons are coming. And he sticks the landing. What an incredible horse. My horsey and my horsey love me. Howdy! Hey there, partner. Hey, fellas. I have a meeting with Mrs. Braithwaite. My associates are already here. All right, that's enough. Move along now. Thank you. Appreciate it. Howdy. Hand, sir. This way, sir. A gentleman to see you, ma'am. So, your friend, the other liquor vendor. Hello. Hello, ma'am. Arthur, welcome. We we're just playing cribbage. Arthur Morgan, Mr. Cribbage. Nice to see you again. Apparently. So, this one, he is big and as dumb as he looks? <laughs> well, he's surely big. But what you talking about? This is a matter of some conjecture. Some say he is as dumb as he looks, but I think 
Well, he's not quite that dumb. <laughs> so these are the boys going to Caliga Hall? Yes, we can take care of that for you, but one hates to be coarse. There is the question of money. Good old Sean. <laughs> oh, we've got money, Mr. Matthews. Paper, bonds, metal. <laughs> she ain't gonna pay you with a certified check, you Yankee numbskull. Ain't childbirth just the most beautiful miracle on earth? Seems a lady can birth monkeys, after all. <laughs> Hey, Hosea. That's funny. Come on, Sean. No, I'm driving. Fine. Terrified like big brother and little brother. It's funny. All right, let's get this over with. All right, let's go. See those things? I don't know what the hell those are for. And I feel like I don't really want to know. Shove that silver spoon down his throat and pull it uh. out of his head. A smug fucker. Okay. <laughs> so what she got us doing at the Gray's place? She wants us to torture tobacco fields. Said they ain't had rain in weeks round here. Hell yeah. Yep. Using that back there. Moonshine. Horns faster than kerosene, that stuff. It does. <sighs> Thinking this hell about why toy fitting my boot up your hook? No, just snotty old bitch. <laughs> Those here really picked the right fella for tea and banner, didn't they? Ah, oh, he was giving his usual flannin. One of these families got gold stashed somewhere. He reckons I'm in. Mean, I'm offer sticking to rich folks. I hate rich folks. <laughs> there be some bloody money at the end of all this. Jose knows what he's doing. Does he do I'm sure there will be some. Finagler of nothing. <laughs> So far, we've destroyed the Braithwaite still. Tried to sell the shine back to them. Now we're on this fool's errand. I'm very much looking forward to, by the way. They were saying old man Gray's double security after that business at the saloon. We just robbed their horses, too. Oh, we Jesus. So, we're just gonna drive on in. Yeah, we're really we got scraping ground. the bottom of the barrel with this, man. Equipment, payroll, especially now they're taking on all that barrel full of snakes. We're making a delivery. That's all. Just leave it to me. I can talk the dog off a meat wagon. <laughs> all right, then. Oh, I know you can, Sean. I know you can talk. Definitely know you can talk. Boom, 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 boom. Imagine freaking uh, subwoofers in the back of this wagon. <laughs> oh, that'd be awesome. Whoa. Hold up a second. The wagon would probably break, but. Grays, English. Excuse me? You not worried about them Grays? In what sense? Well, they know you. Yeah, maybe you're right. You know what? Here. I'll go hide and back if you can act naturally and stop us from getting into a fight before we're ready. I will try. Yes. Try and do an impression of a human being. I'm not going to go that far. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my hat's sticking out. We're here. Stay out of sight. I'll do the talk. Hold it right there. Hey. Howdy. What you want, boy? I've, I've, there, there was a thing, a, a, a thing, at the saloon. What you talking about? Well, I'm delivering this. Well, what you talking about? You're not the usual driver. Uh, you want a bottle, friend? Here. Uh, uh, have a wee drop. <laughs> I'm new. I, I mean, you no know, harm. Uh, <laughs> I, I've come from Donegal in, in Ireland. You know, oh, that's why it's doing that. <laughs> He said you'd understand uh, some kind of incident at the saloon in town. I was told to bring this up here. Ask no questions, I'll tell you no lies. Uh, sort of business. Uh, uh, before the officials got there, okay. they said. Okay. Grab this way. I'll tell you how to get there. Oh, thank you, friend. Uh, have a drink, Sean. <coughs> uh, Hamish. 
There we go. I was trying to do the different camera angle, but... I'm not as fine as Connemara, but fine nonetheless. My people come from Scotland. Is that right? And you and I are nearly brothers. <laughs> Just over here. All right, dude. Moonshine is disgusting. I don't. I mean, you can make it good, but the moonshine I've had. Ugh. I had some good moonshine before, but if it's just straight moonshine, no like flavoring in it, like no peaches or strawberries or something, it's pretty nasty. I think. More of a whiskey man. Oh dear, oh dear. I'm sorry to hear that, Hamish. Sounds like you definitely deserve that drink. <laughs> you don't know the half of it. Just in there. Uh, right there we are. go. Oh, well. Alright then. Right you are. <laughs> you can unload it here. In here? <laughs> <laughs> the horse is like a, a <laughs> one, do they? <laughs> Excuse me? Um, nothing. It's grand. <clears throat> uh, quite a place you yeah. boys have got here. <laughs> Reminds me of one of them big houses there. Uh, open done. Nice. Oh. Real fancy place as they was, Hamish. Real fancy. Because if some folks got all the money. They can build quite the fanciest places imaginable, eh? Mm. Well, the average man, so... Nice! Geesh. That's brutal. I'll open here till it gets dark. How are you getting on? Good. Nearly got these things ready. Okay. Hey, you get no. I'm gonna start saying that. Here's how I feel we should deal with things. You head over to the dry box. Sure. And you? I'm gonna deal with the fields themselves. We coat everything in moonshine, and then we light things up with these little fellas here. Thankfully, it ain't rained. That old barn over there should go up like a torch. <laughs> how many of these boys you think you need? They should do it. Three, four, look. <laughs> Five, six, seven, eight, us, nine, be no turn ten. Back, so move quickly. <laughs> Sorry. I'm rebel stock boy. I was born born down my houses. We'll burn quietly. All right. Whoa! Oh, I thought he was facing us. I was like, whoa. already arrived this one didn't strange so what you got there tools payroll okay drop it by the supply shed at the back of the fields sure see you later you hear that payroll, payroll. yeah let's get this job done first okay just let me deal with our friend here i guess money's a universal language isn't it You douse the fields, I'll meet you at the barn. All right. I stay out of trouble. Oh, there's a dude there. That's good for you. Douse these fields. Let's freaking do it. Should be enough for here. All right. Oh, There's a guy there.
That should do it. All right. Uh, fucking guys everywhere. There's people everywhere. People, people everywhere. Please don't turn around. 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 No, 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 no. Ooh, that was close. Whew. He turned around. That's good. All right, next. All right, two more, two more, two more. Damn, there are guards everywhere. Come on, turn around. Not you. The other one. Hey, I fucking... There we go. Hey. Freak me out. All right. Oh, there's Sean. I was like, dude, who is that? <laughs> Get him, Sean. All right. Well, you a quick as well. Hell yeah. She'll go, Arthur. Light her up. Oh, she'll go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, now let's burn those bloody fields to the ground. Somebody shoot him already. Nice. That's it. Uh, All right then. Look out. Stay with me. Are you gonna get your gun out, Arthur? What are you doing? Fucking damn, man. This is bloody mad. Nice. All right, he's dead. Nice. There goes out right out of here. Come on now. All right. They seem to be taking a well. This is a goddamn mess. Wow. I am bad at aiming. They didn't tell you that being on Don't have no more. They didn't tell me nothing. Really? Guess I should have bought ammo too. Oh my gosh, man. Why am I not? Oh, I got more ammo. It's a different type of ammo. Alright. Here we go. Oh, no, you won't be a man once you're done with you. This is what it's all about. Oh, Arthur. Glad you're having fun. 
All right. Let's move up. Ah, uh, duck, Arthur. How about you, duck? Did? I like this gun better. Nice. All right, let's go, son. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh, they shot his hat off. Don't shoot my hat off. Let's go. Let's go. Where? Nice. I know Braithwaite. All right, let's go, Sean. Nice. Let's go, Sean. Let's freaking go, Ow! Where are they at? Oh, Sean got him. Oh, he wants the payroll. Nice. Get on. There we go. Wait, did I? Okay, yeah, we got it. We got it. We're good. We're good. We're good. Let's go. Let's go. Hell yeah. Come on, Sean. Let's go. Let's go. All right, then. These are big horses. Nice. Went pretty well. You call that a party? That great weight hat got our money's worth, Arlie. She did. She definitely got her money's worth. It kind of begs the question. Well, I guess they were both raised on those lands, but it's like, why don't you just fucking move if you guys have such a problem with each other? Like, I think we lost them. so dumb. That we did. Quite a night. Sure. Interesting little sure. Just put us into the middle of here. Yeah. I hope Excuse him and Jose me. are right and that there's some money at the end of it. What now? For real. Head on back to camp. You coming? Yeah, I'll, I'll go with Sean. Sure. I don't have much else to do. Sure. I like the way he says sure. Damn, look at that. We messed those fields up. Here we are. Home sweet home. You let Jose know how we got on. Will do. Hey. Will do. Eight hundred and fifty dollars. That is what I'm talking about. Let's uh, give some money to the camp real quick. Some more money. Actually, before we do that. Oh, this isn't my horse. This is a different horse. My horse is over there. It's a horse we took. Um, where's the camp box? There it is. It's over here. 
No, not Micah. Fuck Micah. <laughs> we'll do his mission here in a bit. First, we're going to give to the camp. Give items. No, not the gold bar. That's all we have for items. All right, we'll give money then. There we go. Nice. All right. Now let's go talk to Micah. We're at 44 minutes. Hell yeah, dude. What's up, rat? Micah. Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called... Hey, Molly, where's Dutch? Well, however it goes... I'm not sure all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Uh, that's because I got a bullet hole in my head. A man of profoundly limited intelligence. No huh. doubt. Well, you and the old man and Dutch have been running around, digging us ever deeper into shit. Old Mr. Pearson might have gone and lightened the load a little. Pearson! Ain't you curious? I guess. Gentlemen. Dutch, you tell him, fat man. It's peace, Dutch. The O'Driscolls. I mean... I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. I met a couple of the Adjusco boys on the road in the town. And things were about to get ugly. But you know how I am in a fight, huh? Like a corner tiger. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, now somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end things. Like gentlemen. Gentlemen. <laughs> Comb O'Driscoll. <laughs> That ain't gonna work. Your minds. You're always telling us, Dutch, do what has to be done, but don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parley? It's a trap. Well, of course, it's probably a trap, but what do we got to lose finding out? Get shot. Micah, that's a stupid... What? He'll be protecting us. My gosh, man. It's a trap. You shoot a lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that's slim chance. I don't see the point in any of this. It's a chance. Such a dumb idea. Gotta take. I killed Combs brother. A long time ago. <sighs> then he killed a woman I loved dear. Mm. As you say, it's a long time ago. Dutch. Let's go. You and me, with Arthur protecting us, no one... Ah, uh, it's a dumb money. idea. This ain't the time for tigers, my friend. <laughs> this ain't the time for tigers. Go eat your cornflakes, Pearson. Uh, Frosted flakes, I'm sorry. Fine. Mount up then, Morgan. Let's I'm then. on my horse, Micah. How about you don't talk to me? How about that, Micah? Yeah, and how about you learn how to ride, Micah? You fucking... <laughs> you know, I've been fighting Comb for so long now, I can barely remember a time when it was different. And you're still fighting him now. Make no mistake of that. Here he goes. Doubting Tommy. I'm He's not doubting. It's a fact, Micah. Just nervous. Let's not waste any more lives needlessly. I ain't costing lives here. I'm saving them. What did you say? We had Pinkertons coming after us. Because of Blackwater and Leviticus Cornwall and his private army. Then it, who knows when this local hillbilly thing will come to a head. Hmm? And we really afford to be fighting on all these fronts and O'Driscoll. There is wisdom in that. Uh, I hope so, gentlemen, but like I said, I'm nervous. Look, 
I mean, he's got a point about the fighting on all those friends, but... And I hate to say it because it's Micah, but... Oh my gosh, what is happening? There we go. Okay, just keep calm, because I'll give you a reason not to. Oh, we'll be fine. We got you. I will do my best. Oh, my dear and trusted friend, with you watching over me, I would walk into hell itself. Would you, Dutch? Would I. Shut up, Micah, no one asked you. Sorry, Dutch, that was my bad. Hey, y'all. Men on the ridge. Old Driscoll's from the look of them. I don't like having eyes on us. We're close. You'll be the eyes soon enough. Dude, this is bad. This is bad news written all over it. What the hell are we doing? I have pushed too hard. Got us into situations that That's so dumb. I just... Hey, my horse bonding. I hate him. Too much. There's no such thing. This is horse shit. For real. It might be. Micah might be full of shit. Como Driscoll might be full of shit. The promise of this great nation. Men created equal. Liberty and justice for all. That might be nonsense too. But it's worth trying for. It is worth believing in. Can't you see that, friend? I don't know. Try. All I ask is you try. I've been trying, Dutch. My girl don't make no damn sense. Alright, cowpoke. You're gonna peel off up ahead. We'll be meeting down on the plane. Find a spot just above us where you can keep an eye on things. All right, all snake right, bait. Right. That's your name now, cause you're a rat. I don't like that guy. <laughs> if you haven't been able to tell. All right, Mr. Green, you keep eye on my back. Is that a coyote? What is that? There's Dutch. There's snake bait. There's a dove in my ear. There's the old Driscolls. There's Colm. Hello, Dutch. It's been a while. <clears throat> sure. So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believing in you? Better world. Pure world. Hmm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Mm. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that. It's like I said, is it? Charismatic leader. A lot of heat on Tensions are high. Time. Oh, 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 they offered a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, still might. I am sorry about your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. Damn. You always loved the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. I like that match. What are we doing here? Go home. 
Is this thing over? Damn.